Hi, I'm Noel Leo Almendares from Urdaneta City University, taking up of Bachelor of Physical Education. And our topic for today is all about lifestyle for health, wellness, and fitness. Wellness is an active process of becoming aware and making choices towards a healthy and fulfilling life. Wellness is more than being free from illness. It is a dynamic process of change and growth, a state of complete physical, mental, and social well-being and not merely the absence of disease or infirmity. Good health, wellness, fitness, and healthy lifestyles are important for all people. A good and healthy lifestyle is quite beneficial for everyone. There are countless benefits of healthy lifestyle for the people of all ages, kids, teens, adults, and old. Achieving a good and healthy lifestyle is very simple. It is nothing more than adopting the certain practices of healthy behavior towards healthy life. Maintaining a good and healthy lifestyle helps you to stay away from chronic diseases. Just follow these three easy steps for healthy lifestyle and enjoy the life you are living. Step 1. Proper Exercise Exercise is a physical activity that helps to maintain the physical fitness of the body. It doesn't only strengthen the muscles of the body to stay healthy and well, but also enhance the immune system and prevent from chronic diseases as well. To get a healthy lifestyle, include exercising in your daily routine along with a healthy diet. There are different types of exercising are available. You don't need to spend hours and hours for the sake of long workout. Step 2 Healthy Foods When eat foods, our body uses it to yield energy. In this process, there are a lot of chemical reactions occurs that produce energy from this food and we use this energy to grow, to stay healthy, and to do our everyday work. Therefore, practicing to have a healthy diet is very crucial for your healthy lifestyle. Being busy with job, kids, school, and other responsibility, we usually don't bother about breakfast. Never skip breakfast meal. Eat leafy green vegetables, protein, iron, fiber as well are very necessary to remain energetic for living a healthy and happy life. Step 3 Meditation Meditation itself is a process of putting mind into the silence mode in order to spend peaceful time with positive thoughts for relaxing the mind. The major purpose of goal of meditation is to attain an internal peace and intensify personal and spiritual growth. In practicing meditation, you need to concentrate it, focus on something specific like sound. As a meditation comes in the process of relaxation, and its benefits are endless. Lifestyle Fitness There are 7 ridiculous easy habits to get you healthy and fit for life. Number 1. Stop making excuses I know you're too busy to go to the gym. It takes too much time to pack a healthy lunch and it's too hard to find something healthy to eat out. You would work out at home but you don't know how. All of these excuses are valid in their own way, and yes, we've all been there. But if you really want to get and stay fit and healthy, you have to learn to give up your excuses and start making your healthy and fitness a top priority today. Number 2. Walk more Even if you go to the gym 6 days a week, the real key to lifelong fitness is to simply be more active and walk more in your day-to-day -day life. Try making a conscious effort to walk whenever or wherever you can. To the grocery store to get your afternoon coffee or go on a post-dinner stroll with your family. Aim for at least 10,000 steps a day. Number 3. Don't always deprive yourself. Although it may seem counterintuitive, striving to always be perfect, 
with your nutrition is actually not a good long-term strategy to get or stay in shape. Depriving yourself of a dessert and all the foods you love will only result in a binge of those very same food when your willpower is having a moment of weakness. Instead, try following the 80-20 strategy. Eat healthy around 80% of time, then let yourself have some treat here and there. Just make sure they really go once. Number 4. Find activities that get you moving. Instead of always going to the movies or sitting around for long meals, try finding some activities you and friends or loved ones enjoy doing together. Go for a bike ride. Take a scenic hike. Set up a game of bossy ball for the whole family to enjoy. The list is endless. Not only will you get moving, but you're bound to have more fun as well. Number 5. Shorten your workouts. When you have to plan an hour or more for a workout, of course, it's not always possible to go to the gym. But when you pack your entire workout into an efficient 10 to 20 minutes heat workout that works your entire body and leaves you soaked in sweat, you will no longer have the same excuse to skip your workout as often as normally would. Just remember to work hard. Number 6. Make sleep a priority. Many of us underestimate the importance of a good night's rest, but it's crucial for long-term health that you can give your body a proper amount of sleep each night. And if thinking long-term isn't enough of an incentive, remember this, too little sleep can also impair weight loss, efforts due to raise cortisol levels. Try to get around 7 to 8 hours a night on a regular basis. And the last number, number 7. Find ways to actually enjoy your veggies. Vegetables are packed with important nutrients that keep your body healthy. And their fiber content also helps fill you up. So if you don't love plain salad, find ways to make your veggies interesting. Roast them with a little olive oil, salt, and pepper. Toss them into a flavorful stir fry or blend them into a juice so you don't even know that they are there. If you don't despise them, you're much more likely to eat vegetable on a regular basis. And next, how to create a wellness lifestyle. Creating a balanced lifestyle is what I want to inspire through my blog. Being brave by pursuing your biggest creative goals, making delicious nutritional recipes, Finding one's purpose, learning how to have healthy relationships, and so much more. Here's an infographic that created to describe the six different but equally important part of wellness. First is emotional wellness. Have a positive attitude, high self-esteem, a strong sense of self and the ability to recognize and share a wide range of feelings with others in constructive way. Second is spiritual wellness. Find meaning in life events, demonstrate individual purpose, and live a life that reflects your values and beliefs. Third is intellectual wellness. Be open to new ideas, be creative, think critically, and seek out new challenges. Fourth is physical wellness. Take care of your body for optimal health and functioning. Fifth is social wellness. Build relationships with others, deal with conflict appropriately, and connect to a positive social network. The last is occupational wellness. Seek to have a career that is interesting, enjoyable, meaningful, and that contributes to the larger society. Everyone can benefit from healthy lifestyle. The E in health stands for everyone, accepting the fact that anyone can change a behavior or lifestyle means that you are included. Nevertheless, 
many adults feel ineffective in making lifestyle changes. Physical activity is not just only for athletes, it is for all people. Eating well is not just for other people, you can also do it. I hope you learned something from our topic for today and thanks for watching.